Well, so guys, there's a number of ways of mounting solar panels. And of course, uh, a wall mount or a roof mount are, uh, are options. And in this case, we're going to be looking at steel and concrete. And that's what's going on here. So uh, you saw me sliding those uh, caps on there. Those are just glued together pieces. And uh, what I'm doing is I'm keeping the, the rain and snow out because uh, I don't want these square tube to fill with water. And then uh, can you imagine what happens when that freezes? Imagine if you got water like, you know, this much water in there from a summer's worth of rain and then uh, winter time it freezes while well, it's just gonna break up the tubing, you know, and there goes your uh, fancy project. So right now I've got the concrete covered in dirt because uh, this, these have been poured kind of late in the year and I'm trying to keep the frost off of it. We're getting, you know, it's above zero or above freezing in the daytime and below freezing at night. So this is, uh, you know, just to keep the edge off. And I'm going to shovel some of that off of there. I'm going to show you the concrete that's underneath there. So these are 12 inch piles and they go down about six, 16 feet. So there you can see it. And uh, so we came up with this idea to uh, keep the steel from sliding down too far in the concrete. You know, because when you stand the steel up and you slide it into the concrete, you're not really uh, guaranteed how far that's going to go. So I drilled holes in the side of that tubing and then slid that rebar through to the height that I wanted the uh, steel to slide down. So you know, that was the strategy there behind the, behind the steel. So anyways, you get kind of the idea. And uh, I'll finish painting this, you know, maybe uh, when it warms up a little bit. I just wanted some, some paint on the steel for uh, mounting the solar because it's going to be kind of hard to paint around all the brackets and stuff I'm going to make later. But anyways, guys, that's kind of like the latest that was going on around here. I wanted to quickly get this done, get the concrete in before it gets too cold. You know, and I think I pulled it off. I don't think I got any frost damage on that concrete, so, you know, it's probably to the point now where I don't even have to cover it anymore, but it is what it is. I'm still going to cover it up and baby it for a while. So, uh, anyways, guys, this is uh, some, of the, some of the latest of uh, stuff going on here, and I appreciate you guys coming in and uh, checking to see what's up. So, 